They'll slide in. Oh, yeah. I've done this once or twice before. <laughs> All right, so we are here at JCreate with Yvonne. And hey. we're going to chat a little bit about what we've been doing at the Unconference here. Um, and also on my slightly off camera here, we have my good buddy Kirk, who's going to be heckling. heckling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So how have, have you been enjoying the week so far? Uh, this is it's pretty, it's pretty unusual for a conference being on a, on a beautiful island like this. It's, it's fantastic here. Yeah, the, the, the area is beautiful. It's a little too hot for me because I come from, from Russia. Uh, but otherwise, uh, I, it, it's, it's a fantastic opportunity not just to listen to folks, but participate in some very valuable discussions. And it's, it's, it's a small conference, uh, and, but it does give an opportunity to talk. Uh, nice. How, how, how late did you get out? Uh, yeah, I returned home at about 1, <laughs> 1 a.m. That's how it gets. That's a sign of a good conference. Right. And still woke up for sessions this morning. And I woke my roommate to, to give his talk at, in time. <laughs> <laughs> I was almost late. Nice. So what, was, what, what are some of the topics which you, you found interesting in this conference personally? Yeah, uh, there are very vast, um, um, let's say, the polices or uh, areas uh, which were covered with by the conference. I, re I really like the, um, the 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 late. Well, the latest comes first into mind. So the re the reactive talk that Kerr gave. Uh, yeah, that some was of you a lot of fun. Have, may have watched it. We, we have a recording of that, so you can watch that on the Night Hacking Channel. Right. I think that was pretty interesting. Uh, I I like the the way that JIT talk was given, and and even though in JIT is a huge topic. Uh, but the, the 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 guy who was doing the talk, uh, he picked up a specific uh, question of inlining, and uh, talk from that perspective. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah, when get when code gets in line, and how uh, all of a sudden because of inlining uh, limitations or because of the compiler threshold, some some code may work and 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 by increasing uh, the size of rate uh, or is increasing the size of a loop. Uh, the code becomes uh, works again but before it wasn't. So interesting tricks uh, that would uh, kind of uh, leave you um, puzzle if you don't know what's happening under the hood. And under the hood is that just-in-time compilation. Yeah. So is he is he the one who do, did the JitWatch tool? Uh, is that the name of it, Kirk? Right. Chris. Yeah. Yes. JitWatch tool. Right. Yeah. He did JitWatch, and that's a absolutely brilliant tool for. Uh, uh, teaching people uh, what's happening underneath it. I mean, the, the the logs that are produced by the JVM, as you know, are practically um, indecipherable by uh, ordinary humans. I guess, yeah. Cool. Yeah. So it's cool just to have all these like interesting people and topics and stuff happening in a, you know, on the island of Crete. Absolutely. <laughs> so, um, what what are you, what's your plans for this afternoon? Um, I'm gonna be enjoying. Talks with other folks uh, who are still here for another day Ta to have. Talks, talks. Are those like special, special unplanned talks? Well, now that we've got in, not now that we've got into, you know, understanding who's doing what. Yeah. Now some interesting questions. People come, you know, during lunch breaks, during afternoons and dinners, uh, you know, drinks afterwards. <laughs> People come <laughs> over and 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 want to chat to you about, you know, the stuff that you're probably knowledgeable about, and that, you know, I'll go likewise to. Folks that are to knowledgeable folks that you else. know are knowledgeable in different yeah. areas. Yeah, we we just off camera. We were trying to um, <coughs> bug him about his work at Azul and some of the stuff that uh, Azul <laughs> was doing. So I could sort of you know scratching my head, going like, okay, what do we do with this now? You know, and and yeah, yeah. see that you already what, got what a do topic we do for with this. this yeah, exactly. So yeah, so what do we do with this? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Is that a question? <laughs> I, I think he asked you a question. I think I asked a question. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's very open ended, so. Uh, you want to talk about what Azul does, or is it? Is well, yeah, you, you, there, you've recently done something I don't think many people are aware of. So, I, yeah, why yeah. don't you describe it a little bit and tell us what's going on? Um, so we, um, so traditionally we've been doing uh, a virtual machine called Zing, and it's, uh, and it's one segment of of customers that who are looking for low latency um, environments and and want to have an extra responsive. <laughs> Uh, real-time like uh, uh, VM, uh, but uh, then we realized that there is uh, one other opportunity out there, and that's for folks who want to stick to Open JDK um, implementation, uh, but don't want to prioritize it themselves. Um, so we 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 have we created a project called Zulu, 
and we create binaries now for Linux, Linux, Windows, and Mac OS. Um, and uh, that is an OpenGDK, pure OpenGDK built uh, uh, for, for, for everybody to use. It's uh, licensed under GPLv2. You can download it. Uh, updates are coming very frequently, shortly following um, the Oracle ones. Uh, so here's a question. We were talking about JitWatch. Does that work with Zulu? Uh, yes. Cool. Not that I have tested, but I cannot imagine <laughs> <laughs> it would not work. <laughs> so uh, it's something to test when you get back as well, just to see how, see how well it works. Absolutely. It's interesting. There's nothing in OpenJDK that would prevent it from working. Yeah. 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 That's why I, yeah. I, I asked no, answer before is, testing. This is, you know, part of their tool set. Absolutely. Yeah. I, yeah, we, we were thinking about the other night, so we should test it with Zing as well. Uh, that can be uh, a little more tricky because yeah, Zing so is that's, that's further out. Uh, but you could possibly create like a branched version of, of JetWatch for Zoom. Uh, for Zing, for Zing, uh, possibly yes. Yeah. Uh, so it's uh, it's, it's a possibility. Um, yeah. Cool. So that's what we do. All right. Well, thanks very much for joining me on the on the live stream. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thank you for inviting me.